on you talk to the TV. Let me pull this That's, away. Yep, pull away. We can stand six feet apart, which is what the CDC guideline is. And then that way I can take this off the top. Who wants a deal? I, I, may I finish, please? Well, I'm more than 10 feet away. I'm not, well, okay. I'm not going to talk to the rest. Well, according to, to CQ roll call. With all due respect, and you know we've known each other a long time, you really don't know what you're talking about. Do you expect enough Senate Democrats to back that so that it has a shot at passing? And you yeah, want, but you know but what? there's you, a lot okay. there. <laughs> the Senate went on vacation. I mean, you just don't <laughs> do that. Now turning to a topic of agency rulemaking, really sexy topic. You're not aware of any effort to go back to the good old days of segregation by a legislative body, is that correct? Some buttheads. I will approach every case with an open mind. Open mind. Let me just say on that kind of point, you have a right to remain silent. <laughs> Nobody wants to live in accord with the law of Amy. Amy, Tony Barrett, Amy. Tony Barrett! I'm sure you, my children don't even want to do that. Posters that are right outside of this building that, that have pictures. Senator Lee, you're on the poster. Chairman Graham, you're on the poster. And the, the posters say, Supreme Super Spreaders, Politics First, Health and Safety Last. Ready? It's actually it's a pretty good picture of Senator Lee. It's not as good a picture of Chair, Chairman Graham needs to work on getting a better picture to them. It's not their fault. <laughs> I guess it's good afternoon, good morning, depending upon what time zone that you're in. I'd like to pivot from uh, constitutional structure to baseball for a minute. I felt so good doing that, and I did it by mail. I'd like to talk about um, the Houston Astros, who are miserable cheaters. Uh, Sorry, Cornyn uh, and Cruz. They, they steal signs, uh, they bang on cans. Um, They've done a whole bunch of miserable things. My mind's getting mushy this many hours into the hearing. Thank goodness the First Amendment protects that right for him to express <laughs> that erroneous opinion. And the junior senator from Texas now rushes into the room <laughs> to do some homerism. It was going uh, so well. <laughs> I'm like Bluto in Animal House. I'm just <laughs> fat, drunk, and, and, and stupid. During this COVID time, I've seemed to put on a few more pounds. Let me apologize up front for this metaphor I'm about to use. I know it will insult the two vegans on the committee, me and Senator Cruz. Um, but I believe... <laughs> Point of personal privilege. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, Senator It may Cruz. be one step below the Houston Astros thing. <laughs> Coming I, just want the, I just want the people of Texas to know the truth. He is a closet vegan. Um, <laughs> it blows my mind that any rational person could believe that. I, I recognize, Mr. Chairman, that this goose is pretty much cooked. 